The Persian Cat The Persian Cat is a long-haired breed of cat characterized by its round face and short muzzle. It is also known as the Persian long hair in English-speaking countries. The first documented ancestors of the Persians were imported into Italy from Persia around 1620. Recognized by the cat fancy since the late 19th century, it was developed first by the English and then mainly by American breeders after the Second World War. Some cat fancier organizations breed standards subsume the Himalayan and exotic shorthair as variants of this breed, while others treat them as separate breeds. Hi there, I'm Grace and welcome to Kitten's Corner. Here we'll talk everything cats, for cat lovers, just like yourselves. If you haven't already, please be sure to paw that subscribe button, and don't forget to like and ring that bell to be notified of future videos. Before we continue, how about a quick trivia? How much do purebred Persian cats cost? A. $900 to $3,000 B. $100 to $300 C. $20 What do you think? Leave your answer in the comments below. Hang in there, and we'll get to the answer to this trivia question at the end of the video. So, let's take a further look into the Persian. The selective breeding carried out by breeders has allowed the development of a wide variety of coat colors and led to the creation of increasingly flat-faced Persians. Favored by fanciers, this head structure can bring with it a number of health problems. As is the case with the Siamese breed, some breeders have made efforts to preserve the older type of cat, the traditional breed, having a more pronounced muzzle, which is more popular with the general public. Hereditary polycystic kidney disease is prevalent in the breed, affecting almost half the population in some countries. In 2021, it was ranked as the fourth most popular cat breed in the world, according to the Cat Fanciers Association. The second was the exotic breed. Origin The first documented ancestors of the Persians were imported from Khorasan, Persia, into Italy in 1620 by Pietro della Valle, and from Angora. Ottoman Empire, into France by Nicolas-Claude Fabri de Peresque at around the same time. The Khorasan cats were grey-coated, while those from Angora were white. From France, they soon reached Britain. Recent genetic research indicates that present-day Persians are related not to cats from the Near East, but to cats from Western Europe. The researchers stated, even though the early Persian cat may have in fact originated from Persia, the modern Persian cat has lost its phylogeographical signature. Development Persians and Angoras The first Persian cat was presented at the first organized cat show in 1871 in the Crystal Palace in London, England, organized by Harrison Weir. As specimens closer to the later established Persian conformation became the more popular types, attempts were made to differentiate it from the Angora. The first breed standard was issued in 1889 by cat show promoter Weir. He stated that the Persian differed from the Angora in the tail being longer, hair more full and coarse at the end, and head larger, with less pointed ears. Not all cat fanciers agreed with the distinction of the two types, and in the 1903 work The Book of the Cat, Francis Simpson states that the distinctions, apparently with hardly any difference, between Angoras and Persians, are of so fine a nature that I must be pardoned if I ignore the class of cat commonly called Angora. Bell goes on to detail the differences. Persian coats consist of a woolly undercoat and a long, hairy outer coat. The coat loses all the thick underwool in the summer, and only the long hair remains. Hair on the shoulders and upper part of the hind legs is somewhat shorter. Conversely, the Angora has a very different coat, which consists of long, soft hair, hanging in locks, inclining to a slight curl, or wave on the underparts of the body. The Angora's hair is much longer on the shoulders and hind legs than the Persian, which Bell considered a great improvement. However, Bell says the Angora fails to the Persian in the head, Angoras having a more wedge-shaped head and Persians having a rounder head. Bell notes that Angoras and Persians have been crossbred, resulting in a decided improvement to each breed, but claimed the long-haired cat of 1909 had significantly more Persian influence than Angora. Champion lamented the lack of distinction among various long-haired types by English fanciers, who as 1887, 
decided to group them under the umbrella term long-haired cats. Characteristics A show-style Persian has an extremely long and thick coat, short legs, a wide head with the ears set far apart, large eyes, and an extremely shortened muzzle. The breed was originally established with a short muzzle, but this characteristic has become extremely exaggerated over time, particularly in North America. Persian cats can have virtually any color or markings. The Persian is generally described as a quiet cat. Typically placid in nature, it adapts quite well to apartment life. Himalayans tend to be more active due to the influence of Siamese traits. In a study comparing cat owner perceptions of their cats, Persians rated higher than non-pedigree cats on closeness and affection to owners, friendliness towards strangers, cleanliness, predictability, vocalization, and fussiness over food. Grooming In a lion cut, the cat's body is shaved, leaving fur on the head, legs, and tip of the tail intact. It may be done to remove matted fur, reduce the need for grooming, keep the cat cool in warm weather, or for aesthetic reasons. Since Persian cats have long, dense fur that they cannot effectively keep clean, they need regular grooming to prevent matting. To keep their fur in its best condition, they must be brushed frequently. An alternative is to shave the coat. Their eyes may require regular cleaning to prevent crust buildup and tear staining. Before we wrap up, let's get back to our trivia question. How much do purebred Persian cats cost? If you haven't guessed it yet, the answer is A, between $900 and $3,000. Well, that's all we have for the Persian. We hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know your thoughts and leave a comment below. We'll see you next time on Kitten's Corner.